Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is me, Reem, and for today's video, I'm bringing you guys a Shop Miss A haul. You already know, you already know, you already know. So you already know I'm a fucking whore for cheap makeup, cheap anything. So I decided to go back on this dollar store website and order some more things. So yeah, and I ordered quite a bit more than my last haul or whatever so yeah let's get right on to this video i really hope you guys enjoy this video um don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and let me know what other videos y'all would like to see um basically um in total i spent 35 dollars which isn't bad it's not bad at all um i got about 30 things so that you know that's like a lot like you know but basically what shama say is it's a dollar store website or whatever this is not sponsored okay i promise wait Pinky Promise is not sponsored at all, but it it is a dollar makeup store, and I've been known about this for like so long, actually, since like I've never really ordered a lot of things from here because it could be a sketch, you know, a dollar makeup, you know, you kind of pay for what you get. Now, before any of you guys start coming at me like it's a dollar, what the fuck do you expect? Exactly why I'm reviewing it, so to help others, like, damn, y'all don't gotta kill the fucking vibe. Like, I know you pay for what you get. Uh, so, let's get right into this video. But first, I have to t take a thumbnail. And you guys know how awkward this can be. So, I'm going to cut this part. <laughs> oh, my God. That should fucking do it. You know what the fuck I do? But anyways, it comes in this really cute pink package. Last time, it came in a box. So... My double chin. Okay, so still look at the packaging. Okay. Looking cute already. So basically, since I ordered things for the face, I'm going to try them on this. I have a bare face, and that's why I'm looking like a naked mole rat. But bear with me. Damn, bro. They really secured this. Dude, okay. I'm honestly pretty stoked about this. I'm not even going to lie. But, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at this. Ah! Don't move. Look at this. So many things. Okay, this time they did not give me a receipt. Wait, they did. They did. They be coming through. They be coming through with receipts. I love you guys for giving me a receipt. I hate when they don't give me a receipt. Okay, guys. So I organized this a little bit better for you guys. Well, not for you guys, but for me to like, you know, because I'll be kind of dumb. But I'm going to go with accessories first. So the first thing that they got was this cute headband. I don't know. I thought this was really like cute, but... If I'm being honest, like, I do not wear any, like, accessories for my hair. But I thought it'd be cute to add to any, like, outfits. Because I don't know what the fuck to do with my hair. It's so short. Literally, I don't know what to do. But, yeah. um, I mean, it's cute. I, I mean, it's ruffled. And this was only a dollar. And it was super cute. Honestly, they were sold out on a lot of things that, that I actually wanted. But, yeah. It's just a cute velvet ruffly thing. I think it's really cute. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. And the material feels really good. So... But next we got these cute little things. You guys know that these are trending right now. But I've been new about them because my mom, she used to use these all the time. And for every year on her birthday, I would buy her a pack of these. So yeah, they're basically just like, let me show y'all. Ready? Then you swoop it, swoop like this. And then what you do is you just clasp it, clasp it that motherfucker on. And the, you have like this cute little messy bun that honestly, I can't rock right now because... But, yeah, this is a two-pack, and they actually had, like, a lot more, but like I said, most things were sold out. So, that was kind of fucking upsetting, to be honest with you guys, but, damn, I swear to God, my hair. Okay, so I also got these pack of earrings. Um, So, these were dollar as well, so you have some small ones, some medium ones, and some big ones. I don't know if it's just me, but I am not a fucking fan of big stud earrings. I don't know, I feel like that's just... And plus, they're, like, probably like, re be really be really heavy. So, like, my ear is going to be, like, you know. But, yeah. And then they come with hoops. Um, So, I mean, I think they're cute. They probably look cute. They're, like, really little hoops. These are little hoops that I got, too. But these, um, these are smaller than these. So, these probably are bigger. Yeah, we also got that. Super fab, super cute. So, now... 
let's get on to the like makeup i believe because that's all i got for accessories i think so they gave me this little pouch and they put everything in here i believe so we have a beauty blender oh my god guys should i f i'm gonna scream okay but the first thing we have right here is this primer so this is a clean slate primer um it just says it's lightweight and melts right into your skin leaving it silky smooth while extending makeup wear so this shade better can walk we're actually really small so this is how it looks it's actually really small um it probably won't last you a lot but it's me okay so it's like cream like lotion sorry i was gonna say crema but like lotion is um here's this i put it on already and it smells like nivea cream like have you guys had the nivea cream it's right here like it smells like that and it's also like really watery but it oh, damn i'm puffing and i'm huffing and puffing and just went upstairs bro oh my god okay so we're gonna use a beauty blender now everybody be coming at me and they're like do you know you're supposed to wet your beauty blender like yes i know sister i do that it's not my fault my beauty blender doesn't work damn here it is it is the wonder blender high def makeup sponge so hopefully this works. I'm gonna go wet it, okay? I promise you guys, if we all start coming in, you're like, chill, girl. See, I wet it. Damn. But anyways, um, so here it is. It's obviously looking bigger, but okay. So we're gonna add some setting spray. So this is um another setting spray. So um, now what I did get. Hopefully this is my color. Who knows? But this is a buildable satin foundation it's actually really small like you guys see how this looks like samples but it it makes sense because it's a dollar but yeah um it's in this um shade pure beige so yeah it's basically a dropper so um yeah hopefully it turns out nice um this dropper isn't working really good like you really have to like Okay, that's it. this foundation is actually really runny. Oh yeah, yeah, you guys see how runny that is? And it smells like fragrance. We're gonna go ahead and whoa, 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 whoa. The smell in this is like fragrance, straight up perfume. Something you'll find at Bath and Body Works. Oh, that's blending. It's blending like really watery. Like, do you guys see that? Oh my god. I feel like the primer is pretty good, but the foundation is actually really ugly. Like, I'm not even lying to you guys. Like, it's actually really ugly. But the primer is just too shiny. So it's not, like, matte or anything. But, wow. I don't know if that did anything. Honestly, I can't really tell if it did anything. But it's actually my color, which is actually, like, dope. You know, that it blended in. But who knows if it blended in or if my beauty blender just soaked it all up. Like, dead ass, like, I've actually never had to put so much on, like, oh, yo, oh, my God. I don't know, guys, I don't see a difference. I honestly don't see a difference. I don't know. Mm, I don't know. I mean, it doesn't look bad, bad, but, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and set it, but I'm going to go ahead and set it with my, um, I, like, my everyday wet and wild um, setting powder, so I'll be back. Okay, so I'm back and I set that. Um, honestly, I don't know what to give this. I mean, I don't think I'll probably... Probably if I want, like, something light on my face. Okay, guys, so just to add, like, a little clip here, I'll put... I'll rate it a 4 out of 10. Just because, I mean, it's a dollar. I mean, what can you expect? But, I mean, I think it, like, covers a few. But, like I said, it is buildable. <laughs> but it smells like fragrance, so it's probably really bad for the skin. But, I mean, it's probably buildable, you know? Um, I don't know. But the primer... I suggest getting it. Beauty blender, I mean, it's really soft. Um, I mean, I feel like it's soaking up most of the products, so that's kind of like a ouch. But um, we're going to go ahead and see the blushes because I ordered two blushes. So, yeah, but I kind of want to try out the two that ass. I don't even know why I got so many damn brushes. Okay, um, hold up. I'm just gonna go right now and see. 
the fact that I am so fucking confused. Like, bro, oh my god, I swear to god, I be rocking with too many freaking brain wow. shoes. Guys, I got it figured out. I got it figured out. I got it figured out. So, one of them is for blush. This is for contour, blush, and powder. So, this is in the F20. This is F13. And this is F14. So, I'm going to be taking out my powder with this, which is the powder brush, I believe. I'm not even sure. The brushes feel so nice and smooth. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. They feel legit. So, for a dollar, I don't feel like they're bad, but they are really, like, flimsy brushes. I don't know if in the makeup community... Ooh, that's really bad. You guys see? Oh, I probably just need to shave my face, but... Okay, but yeah, there, there's the face. I mean, this brush is what it does. It feels like a Wet n Wild brush, so we know we love Wet n Wild... We love Wet n Wild brushes, but this one, I mean, I don't know. Something about the bristles, but they're really soft bristles, like, really soft, but just not my liking, not my liking. What can I say? Not my liking. Um, so now we're actually going to check out these tweezers that I got. Ow. We're going to check out these tweezers that I got. Hopefully they work with the hair because I haven't tweezed my eyebrows in so long. Ooh, that works. It works really nice. These are really good tweezers. Damn. They're really good tweezers. Okay. We're going to go into the blush. So, basically, this one is fucked already. And I feel like if I open it, it's going to go all over the place. But, but okay. This is the perfect blush in the style Frenzy, I believe. Yeah, it's in the style Frenzy. It's a really pink blush, though. But, I'm going to be walking around with two. Oh, look. It's already broken. Ugh. I'm gonna have to go look at RCL Beauty 101 and see if she, um, this is pretty pigmented, I guess, you know, kind of loses its color, like, you guys see it kind of lost its color, it kind of lost its color, but let's see what it does to the cheeks. Whoa, 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 I mean, it's really pigmented, as you can see, but we're not gonna use a lot, because we're gonna use the other ones, but whoa this is really pigmented i hate the color pop one that i have because the color pop one is just like you have to build it up and i literally wasted so much of it but i mean this is really hard to blend i'm not even gonna lie but damn bro i look like it's cold it's cold outside guys because look how rosy my cheeks are oh my that's really rosy oh my god but we're going to be trying out this now. So this is the Starry Triple Blush Palette. I got it because I've seen that it had an orange blush. And I've been trying to see if I can find a new blush for myself. Because the ColourPop one is just not working. So I've been using some James Charles. Like, some James Charles. That's embarrassing. I've been using some James Charles things. But look, they gave me a... They gave me this brush. Like, girl, you really think I'm going to apply blush with this? Girl, I know you want this is stiff as hell. Okay, so we're going to try out the middle one. Whoa, really powdery. Wait, wait. <laughs> what? <laughs> Play that shit in slow mo, Reem. Play that shit in slow mo. Oops. Whoops, my chair broke. Two moments later. Oh, well, well. Rest in peace to my motherfucking chair, dude. Fuck. That was pretty embarrassing, guys. <laughs> it was pretty embarrassing. Not pretty embarrassing, but my earring fell out too. Pretty pigmented and powdery, as you guys. I like that. <gasps> whoa, 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 whoa. I mean, it's nice, but damn, girl. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who dragged the fucking strawberry across my cheek? Because, out. <laughs> This is a mess. Oh my god, this is a mess, dude. Oh my god, how am I gonna... Okay, hold up, let me... See. Okay, we're just gonna get... We're just gonna go with a subtle brush. A subtle look, because, yo. I didn't know it was that bad. Okay, this brush is really flimsy and horrible. I do not recommend these dollar brushes. If you guys want some dollar brushes, go to Wet n Wild. Go see Wet n Wild, because these are not... These are not... They're not the way to go. They're really not the way to go. Um, let me see if I can just kind of fix it up with my beauty blender. I got these five 
six things for the lips so let's see if i can make a combo out of them i'm not gonna use these i've used these before here's the evidence i have one already used up they smell amazing let's just smell them so this one's a watermelon um it smells really good this is the one that i have i always use it's really good the gloss is actually really nice um it's actually a really nice gloss um it's really it's not sticky which is so amazing we love that in lip glosses that way like our hair's not sticking in them every time but it's actually really runny i don't know if you guys can kind of see that but it's actually really nice so it's the pop fruity flavored gloss this is in cherry mm, it smells good it smell like it smell like cola i mean not sorry like cherry cola not like cola but <laughs> okay um this one is in ass as you guys can see it's an ass so it's in peach guys okay if you guys didn't understand my my humor there my sarcastic humor oh my god this is literally so long guys i'm so oh this smells really it smells like vanilla not like peach but i actually don't know how peaches smell so but it's actually really nice on lips really hydrating as you guys can see really good really good um but yeah let's see if we can make a lip combo so i got this in the i'm just gonna well you know swatch it on my on my uh hand sorry dude the blush is really throwing me off oh my god okay this is in the style nom 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 it's a lip liner it's the um aoa studio wonder lip liner so yeah it's like crooked now all this i don't know if you guys can see that but it's all crooked and stuff but let's see how i can apply it well this is oh oh this is actually orange not really brown as it was shown oh and it doesn't really this is orange this is straight up orange okay no this is a no this is a no um and it's not see what we can get from this one this is the la colors i love my la colors literally so amazing they have the best lip liners ever i have this one in the style dark brown but this one is in hazelnut so so it kind of cracked on me it kind of cracked on me but let's see oh this is really smooth and the fact that they carry a lot of like la colors is so amazing you know because la colors is such a good brand oh this is like a really nice brown oh hazelnut is the way to go oh this is like the best thing ever okay i love this i love this this is my favorite thing but we're gonna go in with this lip color in la colors again it's in the style in the buff i literally cannot open these up with my hands i have to use my mouth on well, my teeth sorry what the hell is that okay look i'm swatching it guys right here it's really sheer and it's not like matte so it's not matte it's more like of a sheer kind of thing but it seems like more of a lip gloss honestly than a lipstick so this is the Ma malibu glitz 24 hour wear soft matte lip cream so here it is it looks like this um, this is what it comes with it looks like this okay uh i don't know i'm not really a lip person so and this is the ooh, these seem ooh, they seem to be um a, a more runny than matte. We're gonna move on to eyebrows. Um, so I got this um slim brow eyebrow pencil in the color dark brown since I do have pretty dark eyebrows. But here it is. It's really slim, actually, really slim. So we're gonna be using this brush that we got. It's a spoolie. It applies really smooth, and it's like also like really like precise which is like dope in a in a eyebrow pencil it's like really dope whoa oh. okay so here are my eyebrows this is kind of it ignore the blush i'm still getting used to the blush i don't know i mean it's nice it's just the ColourPop um blush doesn't really show as much on camera it doesn't pick it up i don't even know why but this one is really light it's really out there you know it's really but my eyebrows are really nice i love the eyebrow pencil really smooth they're really so quick to use loving it this is not the eyebrow pencil this is the eyebrow pencil here you go i love that um but i also got a lip brush i forgot to mention but um hopefully it does something i don't know i just got it just because but yeah i got the lip brush this is an f 
F18. So if you guys want to get, get yourself a lip brush, maybe this will work for you guys. But I also got two eyeliner pencils. Um, but we're not going to try this one. We're going to try this one. Because you guys already know how eyeliner pencils are. And I feel like this is too kind of thick to be doing my eyeliner with. So I'm going to be using this skinny type of brush that came bent. Um, but we got two eyeliners. But I got this one in dark brown. It's an eyeliner. But watch it on my... Um, on my... I have knuckle hair, bro. Fuck. But we're just gonna swatch it here. Ooh, that's actually really nice. I feel like this will be dope as a lip liner pencil. It's just a She Waterproof Makeup Matte Eyeliner. Um, so the brush is just kind of like a those brushes, but this is pretty thick to be applying to your eye. That's why I got myself a handy dandy eyeliner brush. If you guys know I suck at eyeliner, um, I tried to do it, but kind of just suck ass. So this is the eyeliner. Um, obviously, I'm not the best at it, so please don't judge me. But um, honestly, it's pretty runny. But I take back on when I said it, it doesn't dry fast because it dries really fast. It kind of feels like acrylic paint. And it's actually, I don't know if you guys can see, but it's actually really patchy. So, oof. But I mean, it's a dollar, you know. But I mean, it does job for being a dollar. So now we're going to finish off the look with a lot of eyelashes. As you can see, I just got a lot of eyelashes. So don't even know why, but I'm gonna go one by one on what. Okay, these are actually so big and fluffy. I actually do not remember them being this fluffy. So each of these eyelashes are a dollar and fifty five cents. Just letting you guys know. Um, but these are the style Carleen. This is how Carleen looks. Carleen, Carleen, Carleen. Y'all see that? So this is how they look on. They're really nice and fluffy. I love these to die for. These are the style Jean really fluffy i feel like the you girls who like dramatic lashes you guys will love these i really suggest these because they're super fluffy and like long like look this is my eyebrow but yeah these are that now let's go try on the other eyelashes that i have on that oh my god these are so tracy and i mean they're really big yeah okay yeah you guys you guys you girls i know a lot of my girls out there love big long eyelashes these are the ones for you guys these are the ones see guys i got you if you guys like natural eyelashes dramatic eyelashes i got you so, okay yeah these are so nice and natural if you guys love natural eyelashes these are the ones for you guys this is in the style jackie go get y'all some tell them i sent you yeah that's the style jackie okay this is really sticky oh my god yeah see guys i think they got it accidentally on my eyelashes like the thing they make it to stick to the box. Oh my god, no, I can't. I can't do these. Okay. But anyways, I'm so sorry, but these are how they look. They seem like they'll look really nice. Here's a little overview if you guys can kind of tell. But yeah, they like I think they look nice. Hopefully they're good or whatever. But I'm just gonna go ahead and apply the Jackie ones because I like those the best. And then I'll outro this video. Give my final thoughts and i'll see you guys in a bit okay um so ignore my eyelashes um basically they're just going through a rough time right now so yeah they're like really uh they're like really nice eyelashes but the thing is that my eyes are literally burning like my eyes are literally burning right now i don't even know why but anyways oh my god it looks so ugly okay i think that fixed it but basically my final thoughts um I love the eyelashes. I give you guys a few ideas on like, you know, which ones. My favorite were obviously these, Jackie, the so nice. The thing is just my eyes are literally burning. So that's why I kind of didn't apply them too, right? Because I don't want them to get in my eyes. But basically my least favorite thing was this and this because it came out, you know, broken or whatever. Um, I loved, oh, and I, I don't know. I don't know about the lippies, you know. But, you know, they're all right. What I did love, my favorites, were obviously the lashes. This LA Colors style hazelnut um, thing. And if you guys have any question about any of these products specifically, let me know. But yeah, I really guys, oh my god. I really hope you guys enjoyed this dollar store. Yeah, okay. But I really hope you guys enjoyed. Oh my god, guys, I have glue in my eye. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this dollar makeup um, haul. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.